Hey, I think most everyone out there is already aware that the New York uh, Attorney General's office is suing the NRA. And not only are they suing them, they are actually uh, putting forth a motion. They are seeking to dissolve the NRA entirely. Now you might ask, well, how can the Attorney General's office do that? Well, since the NRA is technically a nonprofit organization that is registered in New York, well, the Attorney General's office would be the governing body for that organization. And after an extensive uh, uh, investigation, they have decided that the NRA has not been operating as a nonprofit for quite a while. They have not been operating as a typical lobbying group. They have basically been acting as a personal piggy bank for a certain group of people. They are not actually fighting for gun rights. They are just profiting off the fight for gun rights and then using that money to enrich the leaders of the NRA, their families, and their friends. That's not anything that we as gun owners haven't been aware of for a little while now. It's something I've been telling people for years and other people are finally catching up on. They're saying that the NRA not only does not work as a nonprofit anymore, but they have acted so egregiously and been so blatant at what they've been doing that there's no way they could possibly operate as a nonprofit. Again, their reputation is too damaged. Uh, people like Wayne LaPierre sucking millions of dollars out of the NRA, making backdoor deals to keep uh, gun right battles going, uh, paying himself millions of dollars a year, lots of people on the board millions of dollars a year, spending millions of dollars a year on vacations and luxury cars and private yachts, etc. Our money uh, for these guys to uh, live the high life. That's not what nonprofits do. Uh, and I think we've all been disillusioned with the NRA by now. So I, I think most of us can see that this is stuff uh, that the Attorney General's office is putting forward. This stuff is things we already know. Uh, so it's not looking too good for the NRA. Uh, people are asking me like, well, what do you think is going to end up happening? Well, what I think is going to end up happening is since some of the lawsuits require uh, LaPierre uh, to pay back tens of millions of dollars to the organization, what I think a lot of them are going to do is they're going to say, if you don't make us pay back any money, we'll agree to disband. <laughs> you know, so I wouldn't be surprised if that happens. But uh, what I want to talk about here today is I just want to let everybody know that this is going on. This is why it's going on. They, the NRA is technically a nonprofit. And the ILA is supposedly a, a, a lobbying organization that's actually trying to seek a goal. Well, the NRA has not been operating as a nonprofit. They've been operating as a personal piggy bank for certain people. Uh, the ILA has been a sham. Uh, they just make political deals with people for advertising and blah, blah, blah. They don't do anything to promote the Second Amendment at all. And uh, also, there's a big uh, issue of the NRA acting as a foreign asset for big Russian money. So there's a lot of bad things going on about the NRA right now. Too much to talk about in this video. So I just want to let everyone know that tonight is our normal podcast night. Me and my co-host, Gun Websites, and Never Enough Ammo. So I want to donate, uh, excuse me, I want to dedicate the uh, podcast tonight to discussing the NRA's current problems. So if you're going to be around tonight at 7 p.m. Eastern time, that's 10 p, or excuse me, 7 p.m. Pacific time, that's 10 p.m. Eastern time, uh, come on in. We'll be live on my channel. We're going to be talking about the troubles facing the NRA today, what we think is going to happen, and the things we've seen happen, you know, uh, the political side of it, the practical side of it, etc. So like I said, if you're free tonight at 7 p.m. Pacific time or 10 p.m. Eastern time, and you want to come in and have your say uh, about the NRA, come on in, join in in the conversation in the chat section, and uh, we will dedicate the whole podcast uh, to what's going on with the NRA. Hey, this is the Yankee Marshall just reminding everyone out there that if you disagree with anything I say in any one of my videos, be it something political or tactical, I am going to give you the opportunity to come talk to me face to face instead of just having to put stuff in comment sections where someone might not even read them. You can come in one of my live chats and tell me off in person. You just have to send an email to shootingleftofcenter at gmail.com and in the subject line of that video put slap the yank and then I will get back with you and set up a time where you can come in one of the live chats and tell me off face to face.